Okay, guys, um, I watched part of his live stream, uh, Brian's live stream, yesterday. It's titled 6G, Mark of the Beast, and Elimination of Free Will. Um, uh, I don't know much about uh, uh, 6G. Mark of the Beast, it's either in the forehead or the, um, it'll be in, in the right hand. I don't know what the Mark of Beast will be, I don't know. But, um, anyway, I'm going to play a small bit of it. Um, Ed, can you do a series of videos to, to, to cover... Um, Brian Denlinger's latest um, uh, um, live v v v v video. Okay. Actually, I'll do it in there so we can. And okay, we'll go back to this. That's a live stream with Brian and his wife. Okay. I'm going to see I think we're live. a small part of it at the beginning. Yeah, we're live. Yeah. Okay. Can everybody hear us? Yep. Write in the comments if you can hear us. Just making sure. I'm still, you know, don't quite understand all this stuff. Testing, testing. Test. Yep, one, two, three, testing, and four. Yes, sir. Okay, good. All right, sounds good. Um, we're going to be talking about this thing. I don't know if everybody heard about it, but recently um, Donald Trump, just a day or two ago, came out and said that he wants to fast forward, um, you know, uh, the 5G and also 6G. And I, I did a thing just a few days ago, a sermon about the thing of, um, you know, uh, the mark of the beast and, and whatever else. What is it? Is it here now? And um, and uh, and I talked about, you know, look out for 5G. And so I see this thing about 6G and I'm thinking, OK, what on earth is that all about? Well, what we're going to do is I'm going to show you a um, video here. We're going to switch to a video. And I'm going to show you the video about what 6G is and what it entails. And, uh, you know, and you'll see. So let me see if I can do the screen share thing. We don't really need, um, I guess, this one. Oh, that looks really interesting. Okay. Is it this way I think I do it or something? Or is it this one? I have no idea. I forget. This is such a crazy thing here. Maybe put the I do not remember how to do this. Uh, so that would be shared to everyone, that infinite looking projection <laughs> of your screen. <laughs> Excuse me, everybody. I'm really terrible at this. The I know nothing I don't about live know. streaming, so I can't. Uh, I can't advise you. Right. Here. Yeah, yeah Trump has passed six G. He's ready for six 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 G. Okay, there we go. All right, so this is what you're seeing now on the screen here. Okay, we're gonna watch this video. Don't need any sound on it because um, it's just annoying soundtrack. So we're gonna play this here, but we'll uh, let me just maximize this here thing so we can watch it. All right. Okay. See, there's a little delay there. All right. Here we go. See the future 6G edition. I'll pause it here in just a minute. Okay. There we go. We'll pause it here for just a minute. Okay. 6G ultra fast, low latency, real time radio, super Internet of Things. Yes. Correct. Um, connected devices 
interoperability, sensing based ops operations, in other words, uh, data. Is Artificial that, intelligence. Yep. Smart operation, insight from data, situation, context, analytics. Think of your uh, robots coming online and just spitting everything you say and just creating accounts that you can't even give a good reason for. You, you write a comment and then you think you're talking to a person and it's actually a artificial intelligence robot program to troll your channel. Well, that's mm -hmm. a type of Wrong. artificial intelligence analytics. And the word yep. called radio, that's actually a very simple uh, foundation for this whole system. Radio waves is the foundation for this whole thing. Yep. Okay. So uh, we're going to continue here show you a little bit more and you're going to see how this thing uh, it just really opens the door for what the mark of the beast is okay so you see there intelligent personal edge augmented protection or projection interfaces physical to cyber fusion health analytics services in the hand mm -hmm. okay my health there um Projection interface, cross-service oh, architectures, wireless multi-axis connectivity. Um, <clears throat> what they want, just to kind of spoil the thing here, so to speak, is they're going to eliminate free will. Yes. You will be completely controlled by this whole thing. Um, in other words, there will not be a computer. You will be the computer. You are the Internet mm -hmm. is what the thing is. That's why um, people in the time of Jacob's Trouble, they're, they're, they take this mark. They're not going to be able to be saved because they literally will have, they will no longer have free will. That's the whole point here. And we'll see that as we continue. Right. I mean, you know, I'm going to pause so it here. Right Think about know. it. If they take away uh, your ability to take care of your own health, they're taking the away your free will. I don't know much about All right. This. Continue. Mm -hmm. Machine learning, cybersecurity, out there, edge analytics, sensor fusion, blockchain, sensor to a to artificial intelligence fusion, ambient sensing intelligence, scanning health indicators, smart clothing and environment. Mm -hmm. uh, it, again, it's total control of your will. That's the thing it, that you need to understand about this. This is just you know, I mean, this blew our minds when we saw this video. And what they're actually planning i mean it goes so far beyond what i thought of before i mean it's just wow you know continue Okay, on the fly configuration product game gamification. <laughs> gamification, that's an interesting word. Yeah. Internet of Things, hologram, UIs. You user interface. User interfaces is what UI stands for. Right. There you go. So yeah. it's right. basically just another spin-off of what you're already using when you access the internet through a computer. You're already using a graphical user interface on your computer. So it's just a fancier word for this. 6G type of concept of your right. interface. But you won't actually be looking at a screen sitting down in front of something. Um, you know, it's it goes far beyond that. And of course, what what does the Bible say? Taking the mark, worshiping the beast and his image. image. Mm -hmm. Think about that. But here we have super functional products, multi-dimensional design technologies, electronics and edge analytics, functional materials. So you're seeing things that aren't really there. Right. I mean, oh, brother, I mean, you, you know, you just you could spend a whole lot of time just on one of these things. It's just insane what they have planned. And again, you know, they don't really say it in this video, but 5G is basically I can't say it's a distraction, um, but it's it's not the final goal. It's a smoke screen. Yeah, they can't have 6G. 6G is what they want. And it's not generation. It's Genesis. Great. Okay, that's what they're saying. This, you know, Genesis six, Genesis vision for twenty thirty, up at the top there. Um, right. They want six G, 
but they have to have the 5G, 5G come in as the, gr the grid, the control grid first before 6G can be implemented. Right. This thing is the mark of the beast. Definitely. There's no okay. question. We'll continue. really weird yeah gives a whole new meaning to the verse about worshiping the beast's image yeah paraphrasing course smart materials printed electronics products customizable customizable user interfaces mm -hmm. and sensors personalization 3d internet of things design augmented sensing reusable materials printed electronics so again, you know, everything you do will be controlled. You will not have, um, you will not have any free will. Right. I mean, it's just, right. man, that's what the mark of the beast is. And we're going to get more into that as we continue through okay. this little study here. I don't know anything about this, so I'm, I'm just letting Brian and his wife uh, uh, speak. I'm not playing the music, as I said earlier, because it's really irritating. So I'm not going to sure. do that. Yeah, yeah. Um, wireless multi-radio connectivity, stream analytics, multi-object, Internet of Things, edge computing, mobility as a service, objects and infrastructure, communication, autonomous, safety management. <laughs> you oh, all boy. That. Safety <laughs> management. We're doing it for your safety. You know, when they shall say peace and safety. Right. You know, uh, I mean, it's just right in your face. You know, but see, see, Satan's goal was to take the word of God away from the average person. And so they have no idea anymore what the Bible actually teaches. You know, it's just it's crazy. So this stuff can come out now and fulfill Bible prophecy. And the average person has no idea. But again, look at the removal of free will. Mm -hmm. We're trying to keep you safe by taking away any privacy that you have, any ability to do anything without us knowing about it. You know, that's what it's about. Right. Let's continue. Smart city services, uh, artificial intelligence, observing and catering services. Mm -hmm. They've already been doing this for years and years and years with, with marketing, uh, behavioral marketing and things like that on the internet uh, they're they're tracking what you do and what you you know click on and whatever else and then you'll see ads coming up that relate to that and again you know you have guys like robert breaker and he's making money off of a monetized channel mm -hmm. that's tracking you um now uh robert breaker doesn't make that much money from um monetization but you were making a lot, lot of money from donations. Go fund me, Brian. So, <coughs> so you're being hypocritical, Brian. And and putting ads up that might be, you know, whatever. I mean, the guy's making money off of that. And he already uses robots to uh, promote his channel and yeah. artificially inflate his numbers on YouTube. Yeah, again, so we've, pr we've proved us. that. We've proved that. That he actually admitted in an email to somebody, and then it was sent to me. Thank you to the one that sent it. That, uh, yeah, he's got people that inflate his numbers. Mm -hmm. So they have special systems that can inflate his numbers. And, of course, Breaker doesn't know anything about how it works. Yeah, sure. Come he's, on. He's, he's, uh, he's just innocent. He doesn't know. Of course. You know, he's just there to preach the word that he steals from other people. Yeah. Management of entire city logistics. Sentinel safety and comfort. <laughs> Can you know? Brian, you deceive other people, right? You're saying that Jesus is God the Father when he's the Son. Okay? And there's other things you you do which doesn't uh, uh isn't in line with the King James Bible. I'm sorry I had to say that, Rob, because I worship Jesus. Um, Rob's not perfect, Ed not perfect, no one is perfect, okay, so. We got the, you know, sentient, okay, I'm sorry, I was thinking sentiment, but uh, no, I got it. not quite. Well, yeah, sentient, know. sentient safety and comfort. In other words, the robots will take care of you. Yes. They're here to protect you. It's Rossum's Universal Robots in 
reality in real form. Yeah. So it's it's just insane. And, you know, they already already are, uh, you know, talking about, uh, you know, building these smart cities and things around. There's what what's the one uh, name or something like this or whatever over there in Saudi Arabia that they're going to build it right on top of um, uh, right on top of Mount Sinai, essentially the real Mount Sinai starts area. starts with an N. Um, yeah. The Prince of Saudi Arabia is going to build the thing. It's just insane. I forget what the word is now. Something like that, but you can look it up. But anyway, let's, let's continue. Um, R Robert Breaker, Husky 394XP 2.0, which is Jeremy Carter, his comment, Robert Breaker condemned me to two years ago in an email about my marriage and he is a closet Catholic. So that's what Jeremy Carter has said about you, uh, Rob. Autonomous vehicle. Yeah, okay. Privacy mode, full. <laughs> yes. yeah. You're in the same vehicle. What do you mean privacy mode? Give me a break. That's yeah, just ridiculous. Really. I mean, you know, oh, but they're they're going to create these vehicles, you know, these these vehicles that drive around and things, and and uh, you don't need to have anybody driving it. I think you're insane. Okay, uh, sorry, you deserve to be in an accident if you get in one of these automated, uh, you know, driving vehicles or whatever else. I mean, good night. You know, I mean, I've had GPS systems in my vehicles and things that you know, Garmin, Nuvi, and whatever else. And the thing you end up getting lost because of it, mm -hmm. you know, just about as much as you do, it's you know, finding your way. Guy. And I'm going to trust a vehicle based on that same technology. Ed, um, I'm going to ask you because to cover the two hours and nearly two and a half hours, because two hours, 27 minutes and one second, Brian's live. Um, can you please do a series? Because I don't, I, I don't know much about it, so I'm just letting Brian and his wife talk, and so I don't know whether to agree or disagree because I don't know. Okay, thank you.